Oh, I'm excited to try this out right here. I've got all kinds of fillet knives and any of you that clean fish like myself, then you already know how timely of a process cleaning quite a bit of fish can be. This is going to be a battery operated fish fillet knife. It does come with its own storage case right here. That is everything inside of the box. Let's get this opened up and take a look at this new fish cleaning kit. Wow, it's got multiple blades here on the left. Let me hold this up. Look at this. This thing looks like a DeWalt drill or something. Look at all these different blade attachments I got over here for smaller size and larger size fish. Let's go ahead and get the motorized fish fillet knife opened up out of the kit. Here are the batteries. It does come with two. Here is the charging cable. Go ahead and plug one of them up here. The batteries just have a connection port right there in the middle. I'm connecting that one right now. And once I plug it up, the power charger has a red light that comes on. I'm just guessing once that's fully charged, it may turn green. Can't promise you that. Haven't seen it turn green, just uh, assuming that that's what it's going to do. Looks like it just presses together right here. Check this out. Here's the bottom end. This is the battery here. Here's the bottom end of the motorized fish fillet knife. Okay. Both of those are snapped together firmly there. Here's a close up of it. Oh, I see. Oh, it's got a safety right here. Now, how did I even do that? Oh, that, that was the safety. Was that safety on? That must be safety on. Safety off. Okay, check it out. The opposite of what we're typically used to. Safety on is over here, look. It will not engage. If I push it over this way, boom, see that? Safety off. Fire in a hole. Let's go ahead and get a blade attached to it. This is gonna be really cool. I clean a lot of the smaller sunfish. So let me go ahead and just see. Let me be careful here and try to figure out how these things are even inserted. Here, before I even pull them out, let me show you all these different blades real quick now that I've got this stuff out. Look. I've got a variety of different blade sizes, as you can see right there. I'm going to try to get one of these smaller ones out. Okay. Wait a minute. There's two here. Let me see what's up with this real quick before I tell us something wrong. Well, it looks to me like in the diagrams, both of these blades are in use simultaneously. Let's see if that's the case. So in the picture, I know they're used simultaneously. If I would just use my eyeballs, look. Two slots. That would have been a whole lot simpler if I would have just opened my eyes. Got a button right here, I'm assuming, to open that up. Let's drop these down in here as far as they'll go, all the way till the black touches. And then I'm going to re release right here on my thumb. Press that back up. I'm attempting to pull these out so I now know that they are engaged. And remember, I think I have the safety off at the moment. Let's look at this. Oh, I see. Oh, that thing ain't playing. Look. Look at that. This should take matters and make things a whole lot faster whenever it comes to cleaning fish. I wish I had a bunch of them right here to clean right now. That's, that's about the same thickness as a cutting board. I'd be like...
wonder if I can kind of run that in my stand. That is nice. This thing's got a real nice grip. Feels really comfortable inside of my hand. I got the safety on there. Check that out. Again, it's got one, two, three, four, four different blades to choose from. And it does have a safety. Check that out. Fully battery operated. I got the other battery over here charging now. Let me put the safety back on. To take the blades back out, remember right here, simply press this down and now these blades will pull right out of those two slots and go back inside of i'm going to put them back inside of this safety uh, plastic piece that they came with and attempt to get them back inside of the storage case to take the battery off right here on the sides oh wasn't pressing hard enough. I was right. I just wasn't pressing hard enough. Got to push those two inward there. Not the easiest clamps to get to, if you want me to be honest. Let me show you. Right here. They ain't just uh, easy peasy, if you know what I'm saying. But that's it, that is the new electric fish fillet knife kit. I do like that it includes this storage case as well. I'm get the booklet inside of here. So four blades, two batteries, and a hard storage case are all included with this electric fish fillet set.